Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel 10 e-commerce tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about delete and clear product from the card. So let's see how can we delete and clear the product from the card. For deleting the product, uh, let's create a function inside the card controller. So go to the card controller and uh, here let's create another function. So right here, public function and function name. Uh, let's say function name is remove uh, remove item okay and uh, here just pass here the request dollar request okay and inside this function first of all let's get the row id so create a variable row id is equal to and get the row id from the request so right here dollar request arrow row id and now add the cart colon colon set the instance instance and instance name which is cart and then call the remove method okay and inside this remove method just pass this row id And now return return uh, redirect okay and uh, right here the route name which is card dot index okay and now let's create a function for the clear the card so let's create another function public function and function name clear card and uh, then just write here card colon colon instance and inside this just pass here instance card and then call here the method destroy Okay, and now let's return here redirect to the cart page. Okay, so right here route and the route name which is cart dot index. And now let's create uh, the route for these two methods. So go to the web.php file and here let's create a new route route and method name which is delete and uh, just add here the URI card dot card slash uh, remove and add here the controller name which is card controller colon colon class and method name which is this one remove item so right here the method name remove item and also give the route name which is cart dot remove okay and now let's create another route for the clear the cart so right here route and method delete and add the URI card slash clear okay and then add the controller name card controller colon colon plus and then function name which is this one clear card and uh, Add here the route name which is card dot clear okay now save this file and uh, go to the card dot php file and uh, inside this file let's add here the two form so first add here form for the remove item from the card so right here form and set the id id is equal to 
delete from cart okay and set the action action is equal to route and route name cart inside the single quote cart dot remove okay and then add the method post and now just close this form and inside this form just add here the csrf and also add the method directive okay method and just pass here the method which is delete and now add one input hidden field for the row id so write your input type is equal to hidden hidden and uh, id is equal to row underscore right row underscore row id okay and uh, let's add here underscore d and set the name to row id all right now just close this hidden field and now add one more form here for the clear the cut so write your form and set the id mm, let's say clear card and action double curly bracket route card dot clear and then method which is post and then uh, add here the add the rate csrf and method which is delete method all right now just close this form okay form created one for the delete item from the cart and another for the clear the cart and now let's create two functions javascript function so inside this script tag just create a function here function and uh, let's create first function for the remove item from the cart so right here remove item from cart and inside this just pass here the row id as a parameter and then let's set this value to this input hidden field okay so let's copy this id and uh, right here dollar sign then has this row id and the input id and then, then just call it the val method for set the value and inside this just pass here row id this one okay and now just uh, submit this form using javascript so let's copy this id and uh, right here dollar as sign and paste here the form id and then call the submit method okay and uh, create one more function for the empty the cart so after this just write here function and function name which is um, let's say clear cart okay and uh, uh, from this function simply submit this form so just copy this id form id and right here dollar has and form id and just call the submit method okay now save this and now go, go inside this for each cart inside this for each and uh, let's find the close button close link and uh, you can see here this is the inside this td this is the uh, close icon okay so from this anchor tag just add here on click event javascript on click event and uh, let's call the javascript function this function okay remove item from cart so let's copy this and uh, here just paste and from here it's pass here 
the row id okay so add single quote double curly bracket and then dollar item arrow row id okay and uh, now for clear the card now let's find the clear the card link okay you can see here this is the link for the clear all items okay this one so from here inside this anchor tag just call on click event and call this function clear card so simply write here inside this clear card okay and now save this file now everything is done so let's check so switch to the browser and just refresh refresh the page and now let's check uh, just uh, let's remove this product from the cart so click on this icon and you can see here product has been removed from the cart okay and now let's remove this one you can see here cart cart is empty now let's add more item to the cart so add this one okay added add more item okay one more so click on this add to cart okay now go to the cart so click on this link and uh, let's check the this one clear all items so click on this link and you can see here cart is now cleared okay so in this way you can uh, delete or empty the cart in in this uh, laravel e-commerce project okay so that's all about delete cart item and clear the card from the uh, clear the item from the cart okay so don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks for watching